Welcome back to this new video of Tech Express, everybody. So today in this tutorial, we're going to be talking about um, the browsers are more than just internet windows, right? So we're going to be talking about one of the greatest ultimate browser tire list ranking to the top layers based on performance, privacy features, and groundbreaking AI integration. So stick around to find out if your go-to browsers make the cut or if it's time for an upgrade. So first of all, before we reveal the rankings, let's lay out the criteria. So the performance is how fast it is, how much uh, RAM and CPU does it consume, especially with many tabs. Second about the privacy and security, then the features and innovation, the user experience, which is intuitive, is the interface clean and customizable, how well does it sync across the devices, ecosystem and compatibility, and remember, the best browser ultimately subjectively. So it's aimed for it to provide a comprehensive overview in the 2025th. So an S tire. Into the S tire, the gold standard, for example, kicking out here, we do have the Microsoft Edge. So basically, Microsoft Edge has transformed from a joke into an actual powerhouse. This one is built for Chromium and it's incredibly fast and resource efficient, offering output forming from and Windows devices due to tight OS integration. So this is excellent performer and resource management. This is best in class AI integration co-pilot. And this has a strong privacy features in vertical tabs. Though one of the cons might be that Microsoft ecosystem can be pushed intrusive like Bing and rewards. But this is best for uh, Windows users. Now the second application, uh, it's called uh, here into the S tire, we have the Brave. Now, Brave continues to be a leader in privacy and security, blocking ads and trackers by default with its shields. This also results in significantly faster page loading and lower resources usage. So Brave's built in Leo AI assistance offer privacy focused summarization and content generation without sending your data to external servers. This is optional. Brave Rewards program allows you to earn crypto for viewing privacy and respecting the some ads. So the best pro tip of the Brave is that this one is top tier privacy. So this has a faster performance, low resource consumption, integrated AI assistant, and earning crypto rewards. I believe that the con is that the cryptocurrency features might be distracting for some occasional side compatibility issues, but that's really up to you. Something else, for example, is that we have now into the regular uh, browse, it's called the Google Chrome. Now, the Google Chrome, for example, is undisputed market share leader. So this one remains fast, universally compatible, and boosts the largest extension library. It's tight integration with Google services, like the Gmail, like the Drive, like uh, Gemini, for example, and it's tight integration with a huge draw. This is true with higher consumption and Google data collection practices push it up out of the top tires for many users concerned about privacy. So one of the processes is the fastest in some benchmarks. This is as I just told you, universal compatibility. There is a massive extension library and there's a seamless Google ecosystem integration. And I believe that the cons is that this one uses a lot or of RAM and CPU usage. So this means less privacy focused by default compared to alternatives. Then something else that I can show you, which I think is one of my favorites, is the Opera GX. The Opera GX is, has a summarization and generation specifically to gamers with resource limits and custom themes. This one has a feature pack, for example, like a free VPN, an ad blocker, and good AI integration, which is called the ARIA, and basically has resource controls and unique UI. This is best for users who want to build in tools gamers, those seekers, and all-in-one browser solution with AI. Well, um, I can tell you how the con is based on the Chromium. Some users have privacy concerns regarding to the company past data policies can feel a bit cluttered with the features. But the browser, the features, the privacy security, I think that's even for me, it actually works really, really awesome. And lastly, we have a recommendation that we didn't knew that this one actually was uh, created and designed, but this one actually has come to our eyes lately, which is called the Vivaldi. 
This one is the king of customization because for uh, power users who want to tweak every single aspect of their browser, this one is still offered unique features like the top stacking, the side panels, a built-in mail client, calendars, and much more element. Basically, what you can do here into the Vivaldi is that this one has unparalleled customization, highly feature reached, and strong tab management. Though I can say the cons can be overwhelming for new users due to so many options, not as lightweight as some others. But basically, those are the tools, those are um, the lists that take away as clear. I can tell you that one of my favorites definitely can be Opera GX and the Brave browser elements. This totally depending on what you're actually aiming for. So, if you agree with our tutorial list, you can let us know in the comments below. If this video helped you, you might discover the next favorite browser, smash that like button, share it with a friend, and subscribe to TechPress for more in-depth tech conversion and reviews. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. See you next time.